Hello again, it's me and Carissa, and today we're doing, we got this from Holler Box. It's a little aquarium, and it's got little tiny fish, and we're going to put it together and see how it works. So this tank doesn't come with batteries, so I got these batteries from Holler, too. <laughs> so we got to unpackage it first. Oh, those the batteries that I pulled out. Yeah. <laughs> yep, when I put them in that box. Okay, so then there's like a battery thing, so we need to put batteries in here. Oops, I might need the other screwdriver. I got two screwdrivers just in case. I didn't get these ones from Holler. I got these from my husband's tool kit. Okay. I think the other screwdriver was too big. Yes. So then it needs two batteries, AAs. AAAs, right? Oh, AAs. Uh oh. Go get the AAs. Where are they? In the battery drawer. Oops. A A A A's. A A's. Not A A A's. Yeah, two A A batteries. So I'll have to use some of my own. She'll be right back. So this is what comes in. It has these little beads. And it has two fish. They're supposed to be just random fish, but it looks like Nemo and kind of like Nemo and Dory. Okay. And then you look at my neck, it's like, ugh. Yeah. Because I said, ow, my neck while I was running. Okay, that, this has a little fin that moves. And so does this one. So, on the thing it says just add water, but in one place it said add dish soap, two drops. Um, I wonder if that's going to make it all foamy. How are you going to get foamy. just two drops from that big of a... I know, I got a big bottle, so... Um, well, we'll see. Okay, so put the batteries in. Seal it back up. So we're gonna name the fish Nemo and Dory. <laughs> okay, instructions say insert batteries into compartment. So we did that. Assemble your mini aquarium by placing the fish bowl on the base unit. I'm gonna name it Fishy and Fishy. So I guess even though it has water <laughs> in it, we're still gonna have to tip it a little bit to turn it on, I guess. It says to do this. Okay, um, pour the beads into the fish bowl. Here we go. And fishy, do, fishy. do not put real fish, not even a beta in this little tiny thing. This is, it'd be torture. Okay, fill the fish bowl with water, but do not overfill. It's recommended to use distilled water, which we have, which will prevent mineral buildup on the fish bowl surface. Mineral buildup will cloud the surface of the fish bowl. And then add two to three drops of dish detergent, which you think would make it all foamy. But let's see. Let's follow the rules. Excuse me, Carissa. This is the distilled water. Okay. Let me move it a little bit closer so you guys can see it. Okay. This, I'm probably just going to use one drop because this is a big bottle and it, it goes a lot. Oh, yeah. So that's in there. Okay, and then put the fish in. Okay, put find the on-off switch looking on the base and switch it on. So let's see what it does. I'll do this first. There you go. They look like they're sick fish. Look at them. <laughs> like going head down just like fish do when they're sick. <laughs> so, <laughs> that's about it. This base kind of like vibrates, I guess. Yeah, it gently vibrates to move the water around a little bit. But there you have it. So I got this from Holler. I think it was about $6. I'm not sure. Some of the beads actually float to the top. Okay, so this was the Magic Mini Aquarium. It looks like they're bubbling. Yeah. 
Not very magical, huh? <laughs> <laughs> Could be for, fun for a little kid to watch, but like if you have a real little kid, they, they might eat the fish and choke on them. So and the beads. So this would have to be like an older kid, maybe about six, five or six, that doesn't swallow things. I'd say six or seven. Yeah. Because five-year-olds like to put things in their mouth. Still, still. sometimes, yep. Okay, so there you have it, the Magic Mini Aquarium. If you like this toy review, <laughs> give us a thumbs up. And if you haven't already, please subscribe to see more of our funny Krista and stuff like that. Bye! Bye! Bye. Thank you.